Novak Djokovic versus Daniel Medvedev is the final of the Paris Indoors for 2021. And we're getting a replay of the US Open final from a couple of months ago. Medvedev entered the tournament as the number two seed and got a bye in the first round. His second round opponent was a dangerous unseeded player of Ashka. And after a close first set, Medvedev eventually prevailed in straight sets, 7-5, 6-4. His third round was against the young American Korda. And after dropping the first set, Medvedev had to fight back to eventually win in 3, 4, 6, 6, 1, 6, 3. His quarterfinal matchup was against local hope Hugo Gaston, and after saving a bunch of set points in the first set, Medvedev eventually came through in 2, 7, 6, 6, 4. In his semi final, Medvedev would take on the number 4 seed Zverev, which was set up to be a blockbuster and a replay of the final of Paris in 2020. However, Zverev didn't seem to have the energy, and Medvedev prevailed in straight sets, 6, 2, 6, 2 to advance to the final yet again. Novak Djokovic entered the tournament as the number one seed and had a bye in the first round. His second round opponent was against the Hungarian Fucevic, and after dropping the second set, Djokovic had to fight to win in his first match since the US Open, eventually prevailing in three sets, 6-2, 4-6, 6-3. His third round opponent was scheduled to be against Gael Monfils, a man that he'd beaten 17 times before. However, Monfils was injured and had to withdraw from the match. In the quarterfinals, he would take on the informed Fritz, who had played some really good tennis over the last few months. However, Djokovic didn't seem troubled, winning this match in straight sets, 6-4, 6-3. His semi-final opponent was against a fellow ATP Finals qualifier in Hubi Hercatch. And after dropping the first set, Djokovic would eventually have to fight for the win, getting through in a third set tiebreak, 3-6, 6-love, 7-6 to advance to the final. These two have played nine times before with Djokovic leading the head-to-head 5-4, but of course their recent match was that US Open final where Medvedev got the win. And also Medvedev, he has won four of the last six matches against the world number one. Medvedev's gonna win this one. He needs to replicate that style that he bought into the final of the US Open. He needs to serve well, and he also needs to be super aggressive against Djokovic and not let Djokovic get into a rhythm. If Djokovic is going to win and get revenge over Medvedev, he's going to have to play very clean on the ground strokes. His ground strokes weren't great against her catch, which is why the match went the distance. He missed a couple of backhands and a lot of forehands as well, so he needs to clean it up. And he also needs to block out the crowd because the crowd were a factor in that third set. Luckily, Djokovic got through, but... He's going to have to clean up the ground strokes if he's going to beat Medvedev. So good to see this matchup again so quickly after the US Open. Of course, this is Djokovic's first tournament back since that US Open. But I'm going to go with Medvedev to win in three sets. I just feel like he's playing a little bit better at the moment. And in the semifinals, he didn't have to play as long a match as what Djokovic did. And he looked pretty good, Medvedev, in that semifinal. So I'm going to go with Medvedev to win. But let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this final?